Hey everybody, Miss Letty Dot here. And what you're looking at is what's left of my poor cabbage. Yeah, some critter got into my cabbage and it is now gone. So, uh, at this point, I don't think I'm going to uh, replant or anything. Uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to be done with it because it's just going to happen again. So, yeah, cabbage is done. However, my tomato plants, look at them. They're doing really good. For some reason, they've started to take off. I've got some blooms going here. So, I'm keeping an eye on my tomato plants and hoping that critters don't get into them, but they probably will. Other than that, here's the pepper plant. Um, I mean, it's still got some pretty hardy leaves. The stem looks pretty hardy still. It's just not producing yet, so I'm not sure what's going on with it. And then down here, of course, the squash. It just never took off. So, that's what's going on. But yeah, I am so upset about my cabbage because I have <laughs> babied this thing and it was looking so good. And yeah, we have a lot of groundhogs, squirrels, chipmunks. I mean, you name it. We practically have a zoo here in our backyard. So, I'm not really all that surprised. All right, well, that's going to do it for this video. So I'll keep you posted every once in a while how the tomatoes are doing. So that's going to be it for me on, on the cabbage experiment. But I'll try again next year, definitely. Maybe next year I can come up with another plan on where to put it where the critters won't eat it. All right, thank you so much for watching.